The beginning gains from coming to class regularly are incremental, right? You're going to be more physically fit, your concentration will get a little bit better, typically you'll be a little calmer, and of course you're going to learn some martial arts skills, maybe a little self-defense. Over the long term, though, it can really be transformative. As you put a lot of those elements together, you discover that, hey, I'm not just more coordinated, I'm doing a lot of things better. I don't have to worry about going out in the winter and shoveling the snow. I don't have to worry about carrying a backpack on a trip. I got this stuff. I'm not worrying about my fitness. That's transformative. But here's where the magic really happens, and that is in the transcendence. You can really change the way you interact with the world by training over the long term, getting more physically fit, and putting all these things together. And you'll discover that the people around you respond to that. Now, they're responding to you differently, which means your whole relationship with society and your family is different. You may discover, like I did, that the world looks very different, that you may step into the martial arts as a student or a follower, and you may step out of 10 years of the martial arts as a leader. Here's my story of long-term commitment to the martial arts. I started in 1968, but what was really transformative for me was spending four years in Japan studying with some of the most famous, most accomplished post-World War II martial artists. I went into that period as somebody who had accomplished a fair amount in life, but who was still primarily a follower. But by being around people that were exceptional and really soaking up everything they had to offer and then training like a demon, I found I left Japan as a completely different human being. I was more confident, I had better judgment, I was calmer. Now, far from perfect, still working on it, but I gotta tell you, I like where life is now, having gone through that crucible of four years of training, much better than I did beforehand. And that's the kind of potential that you have as well. If you just commit yourself to the path of the martial arts, you'll find that how you look in a year, how you look in two years, how you look in three years, is nothing like how the world looks to you today. In the next video, I'm going to share a few thoughts about the exceptional martial artists, things that you should be looking for as you see some incredible people around you, and how you can pick up some of what they have to accelerate your gains in training.